And we'll get going with uh, Paul Friesen from the Winnipeg Sun. Go ahead, Paul. Thanks, Gregor. Uh, Blake, was it a hard game to play or, or an easy game in a way? Um, no, I, I think, you know, for our team, we're coming off a, a nice win and kind of a good feeling and just trying to keep that good feeling going in our room. You know, we have a, a lot to look forward to and a lot to be excited about. So, um, yeah, I think there's just a lot of excitement, you know, in our room and around our team to obviously keep keep moving forward. But um, yeah, any chance you get you get to play with a you know a good locker room and good vibe going um, makes it for a, you know more enjoyable night. We'll go next to Jeff Hamilton from the Winnipeg Free Press. Go ahead, Jeff. Thanks, Rager. Hey, hey Blake. Uh, as you mentioned, keep that good feeling rolling. Uh, you know, how important was it to get that win here in the last game? I know it doesn't affect the standings, but just to have that feeling going into playoffs. I mean, realistically, not that important, but um, it's certainly nice to do. It's certainly nice to have some carryover, um, you know, from the things that we've been working on and the things we're trying to build on going into the playoffs. And, um, you know, it, it uh, it's still an NHL game. You know, you got to be a pro about it and, and get the job done. So, um, like I said, you know, it was just good to, to be in a competitive game and, and get a result. We'll go next to Ken Weave from Sportsnet. Go ahead, Weaver. Like, uh, what stood out to you about your lines play since you've been back together? Um, I think we're, I think we're, we're playing at the same speed. Um, you know, I think we're kind of all on the same page, you know, sometimes when things aren't going good, you know, the tendency is to just try as hard as you can. And sometimes you, you try too hard and, you know, I think our line is, is in a good rhythm right now. You know, I think um, we're jumping into holes at the right times and, um, you know, we're, we're being responsible in terms of, um, you know, reloading and, and, and back checking and um, we're creating a lot of loose pucks and a lot of turnovers and, and able to get some rushes going the other way. So, um, you know, anytime you get guys like Kyle, you know, looks around the net, you're going to get opportunities to score goals. We'll go back to Jeff Hamilton from the free press. Go ahead, Jeff. Yeah, Blake, it's 56 games season. It's a shorter season than usual, but I imagine it felt maybe longer than it than it was. What's the feeling after finishing up the regular season, um, given what how unique it was this year? I think just excited. You know, I think, uh, um, yeah, it, it's been a really uh, interesting interesting year uh, for a lot of reasons and. The discrepancy between the you know our division and the other divisions has been magnified quite a bit, and um, so you know um, that's not something we need to get into. But uh, you know, I think the the overriding you know feeling after tonight is just excitement. You know, excited excited about having an opportunity to compete in the playoffs. I mean, that's all. That's what you play for. You play for a chance to to play in the playoffs. Um, one of sixteen teams that has a, a chance to win it all, and. Um, Nobody picked us to, to be alive right now. So we have a lot to be proud of for the way we competed in the regular season and a lot to look forward to. We'll go next to Murata Tesh from The Athletic. Go ahead, Murat. Thanks, Gregor. Hi, Blake. Um, certainly the focus will be on the team, but your March or, whoa, your May, pardon me, has been uh, has been extremely productive. I think that's up to 10 points in seven games, if I've got that right. Uh, do you feel like you're peaking at the right time? How's that feeling for you? Yeah, I told you guys, you know, when I came back from the injury, feel healthy. So um, feel good going into the playoffs and obviously playing with Mark and Kyle. Um, there's a lot there to to, to be excited about. And, um, yeah, I think we like the way our game's going, going into the playoffs and just look to keep it going. And final question to Ken Weaver from Sportsnet. Go ahead, Weaver. Like uh, what's going to take to beat the Oilers? Yeah, I mean, we, we got to tackle that, obviously, uh, in the next handful of days. Um, uh, I, I don't have I don't have the answer for you today, but, you know, we, we definitely have a lot of respect for their team and the, the season they've had. And, um, you know, they, they present some unique challenges and, you know, it's going to be a, a competitive series. So it's one we're, we're definitely looking forward to. Thanks very much.